Hi everyone. Today we're going to discuss about YouTube SEO tips. When you think of SEO you probably think of Google. It's easy to understand why Google is the most powerful search engine period. However, Google isn't the only search engine, not by long shot. I'll even go on record saying that some search engines can be more powerful than Google. Not as big no. Not as popular but if you tap into other search engines, you can boost your search presence and conversion. If you ignore other search engines, you're doing your business a disservice. Today, I want to talk about YouTube, and more specifically, YouTube SEO. It might seem weird to think of YouTube as a search engine, but that's exactly what it is. Specifically, it's a search engine for videos. The entire site is driven by a search bar that's smack dab in the middle of the page. It's similar to Google Video Search Results. Because YouTube is its own search engine, it has its own SEO best practices. Just like you want to get your site high up on the SERPs, you want to get your videos high up on the YouTube SERPs. YouTube SEO is a bit different from regular SEO, and it might take a little while to get used to. To help make it easy for you, I've created a list of techniques that we'll provide. Here are 8 steps to improve your YouTube SEO to drive more traffic and video views. 1. Pick your keywords wisely. SERPs are getting more competitive every month. New competitors, new products, new services, everyone is fighting for the top spots. So, finding ways to diversify yourself and your offering is crucial. Do your keyword research, and unless you can compete with really competitive terms, pick keywords that can get you volume, but are less competitive. You can use the same keyword research tools you'd use for PPC or SEO, like WordStream's free keyword tool, Google Keyword Planner, Moz or SEMrush, Google Search, Search Suggest, People Also Ask, Related Searches, and more. 2. Use keywords in your video title. Understanding the search intent of your audience is the first step. We know that the most common types of search intent include informational, commercial, navigational and transactional. So, matching what your video is about with the intent of your customer is going to be really important for getting your video visible in search results. Secondly, make sure you understand why you want to create a YouTube video and who the primary audience. For instance, if you are looking to showcase a product review, then use the product name in the video title and description. It sounds really simple, but there are so many YouTube channels that miss this step and their videos show up low on Google and YouTube search results. As an example of how competitive the term Dell Computer Review is, this term is something that someone may be searching for when they are considering a product. These videos are pulling through from YouTube but also from other websites and blogs around the web. 3. Include the keyword in your video file name. Has the target keyword in it, your video will have a much better chance of being ranked, and a much better chance of gaining more search volume. So, when uploading a new video, you can see the file name. YouTube uses this to make sure the video is relevant, so ensure your file name is updated before you upload it. Four. Optimize your YouTube video description. One of most important ranking factor for YouTube SEO is making sure you have a solid, optimized video description. Whenever you change or update any YouTube video element which includes video descriptions, subtitles and closed captions, and video thumbnails YouTube will reevaluate the video. This can be good or bad. So it's important you get it right the first time. YouTube recommends that you put your most important keywords in the first couple of sentences of your description and that your description should be no longer than 200 words. Broadly speaking make your description useful. If it doesn't help a user delete it. This is YouTube's way of telling me videos are relevant from the video description. YouTube has some great resources on the YouTube Creator Studio which is a resource that is always updated with current information. It also has a handy list that guides you through the steps to a successful video description.
The info is Include an overview of your video using natural language not just a stream of keywords. Insert the most important keywords at the beginning of your description. 5. Use video hash to drive YouTube search results. Across social media, hash are now used to help users find content that answers their questions across a range of platforms. You can use related hash in video descriptions to help viewers find your video when they search for a specific hash. Tags specifically help drive search as they make key trends more visible. Once you add a hash to video description, it will be shown above the title of a video and then become hyperlinked. It's also important to remember where you include video hash here. If you added hashtag in video title, hashtags from descriptions won't get displayed about the video title. 6. Select a video category. If users are searching for a particular video with advanced options, they can select the search to show videos from selected categories. When uploading your video, it's important you contextualize your video with categories so you will have a better chance of getting found by user. YouTube has a variety of category options to pick from, so you should be able to find category that suits your YouTube videos. You can select category options when uploading your video. 7. Customize your thumbnail image. Thumbnails can help or hinder you. YouTube videos. They are the first thing that grabs people's attention when they look at YouTube search results. A strong thumbnail can lead to higher watch time, which can have big influence on YouTube ranking. Create something that grabs people's attention and stands out from crowds so that your video gets noticed. For X, these thumbnails are just taken from the video itself and are probably not the most relevant for grabbing the user's attention. Creating a custom thumbnail is the best way to see results, showing people what your video is about and how it will benefit them is the real key to success. A great example of a customized thumbnail. 8. Add subtitles and closed captions. Using subtitles and closed captions is the final tip for success on YouTube search. While video subtitles are designed to communicate video dialogue for viewers who can't understand the video language, closed captions are for viewers who can't hear the audio. Both subtitles and closed caption files contain the text of what is said in the video, like a transcript. The file will also contain time codes for when each bit of text should be displayed through video, so it can match up with speech or another visual element. The other benefit of having a transcript for your video is that it can be picked up by broad search engines, just as a blog would. On the video upload screen, you can select your file and video language. There are a lot of really good guides out there for how to create an SRT file for your video. Summary 1. Choose your keywords wisely. 2. Include keywords in the title of the video. 3. Include keywords in the video file. 4. Optimize your description. 5. Use video hashtags. 6. Select a video category. 7. Use eye catching thumbnails. 8. Add subtitles and closed captions. And finally, do your research as you would with any other piece of content. Focus on creating evergreen videos that you can build upon to strengthen your content portfolio. The more helpful content you offer users, more search volume you will get to your business and YouTube channel. Time for bonus strategy. Include the current year in your video title. Now, this hack is very useful nowadays. Example science experiments instead of this you may write as science experiments in 2021 if this helps please like this video share and subscribe to our channel